What is up, you guys? My name is Marcellus, and today I'm going to bring you some K-pop related news. Of course, I am late to this, but anybody that knows me know knows I like K-pop, but I'm not the biggest K-pop fan. Now, Luhan has decided to leave EXO. Now we're down to 10 members. Now, the reason he's leaving EXO apparently is because SM Entertainment is pushing him too much and he's filed a lawsuit to nullify his contract. If you didn't know, Luhan has not been on recent tours with EXO because of health problems. And apparently SM wanted to push him so much so where he couldn't recover from his health issues and that's why he's suing the company. Now I have a statement from SN Entertainment here and I'll leave a link to the article which I'm reading off of on my phone but it says this quote the agency learned of Luhan's lawsuit through a lawyer we are shocked because the lawsuit was suddenly filed while we are in the process of negotiating his future schedules and activities after he expressed his wishes to focus more on individual activities in China more so than EXO group activities as well as matters concerning his health as it was with Chris's case when a lawsuit is filed for no extra reason by using the same pattern and lawyers after gaining a lot of popularity as a star through group activities we see this as a lawsuit that was filed because of one prioritizing oneself and ignoring the understanding of the contract with the agency as well as everyone involved with the contracts and the activities with the group we believe that there is someone behind the scenes who is pulling the strings regarding these kind of situations the agency plans to actively respond to it with our partners overseas including those in China as well as legal experts. EXO's acti future activities will also proceed as scheduled. Now, what SM Entertainment is basically trying to say here is that they're doing this, Chris and uh, Luhan, are doing this because of fame and basically making them seem like they just want to leave and do solo careers. Now, that might be the case, that might not. At first, not knowing much about the K-pop industry, I, I stepped back and I couldn't really judge what SM Entertainment and Chris's situation, situation was. You know, I'm not very into the, you know, the industry of K-pop. So, when that happened and Chris left and, you know, filed a lawsuit, I just stepped back. A lot of people were blaming Chris and a lot of people were blaming SM Entertainment, but, you know, I just stepped back and was like, whoa, I don't, I can't really say anything, but I will miss Chris. Then, apparently... Uh, SM Entertainment messed around and fucked up one of their senior groups, Ger Girls Generation, and I looked at that like, wow, okay, yeah. okay, why would you do that to a senior group, one of the you know most influential groups in K-pop, and then this happened. Luhan basically says, you know, they're pushing me too hard and I, I want to leave. So now I can kind of say that. This is a trend going on, and all three of these incidents can't just be they want to have solo careers, this and that. SM, SM Entertainment might be pushing them too hard or fucking around and trying to just bully them. That is not cool. Now, we're down to 10 members in the EXO. It is really a sad thing to see Luhan go. Um, apparently... EXO will have a comeback the 25th of this month, but <sighs> it's not going to be the same, man. I'm still going to support EXO because they are a talented bunch of dudes, but it's really sad when you get used to seeing the same 12 people and now two of them are gone. It's just, it's just kind of disappointing, man. Um, I don't know what else to say about this um, situation. Hopefully, uh, everything works out for Luhan. We are wishing him the best. Um, I don't know if I'm butchering his name or not. I've never really said it out loud. Um, but we wish Chris and him the best in their future endeavors. You know, I, they'll have my support in whatever they do, as long as they don't become assholes or something like that. But other than that, they have my support, man. Uh... I will be bringing more uh, more K-pop related videos, maybe some reactions to some music videos, this and that. But uh, like the video if you guys enjoyed this. Comment down below what you think about Luhan leaving EXO and SN SM Entertainment.
and subscribe for more K-pop related things. And I'll see you guys later.